Prochain Orateur National Organization for Elimination of All Forms of Racial Discrimination. You have the floor. Thank you, Mr. President. This is a joint statement by EFORT and Geneva International Center for Justice and Youth Against Settlement in Hebron. Our NGOs thank the Special Rapporteur for the outstanding work throughout his mandate and his excellent reports in which he clearly addresses the issues at stake. We, we, we regret that the government concerned did not cooperate with his mandate and that attempts have been undertaken to defame his character rather than addressing the problem at hand. Mr. Special Rapporteur, as you underline in your report, the exploding expansion of settlements in the OPT has resulted in a system of apartheid, racial segregation and systematic oppression which affects Palestinian human rights on all levels. It is especially alarming that such constructions have risen by over 120% in 2013 with roughly 10,000 new settlement units being constructed since the beginning of the peace talks which totally questions the seriousness of these talks. We are particularly concerned that, the, that even the Israeli Supreme Court ru often rules <coughs> and serves the political agenda trying to legitimize illegal settlements. This was the case in the recent decision on the Rajabi House in Hebron. The ownership was disputed since 2007 when a group of settlers stormed the newly built <coughs> Palestinian house. Although it was later found that the purchase documents were forged, it was ruled on 11 March 2014 that the rights to the house will be given to the settlers against the will of its owner. The decision will have the same impact as other settlements described in your report, such as new restrictions of movement, additional road closures, and increased cases of settler violence in addition to the already tense situation. It may finally lead to a total closure of the area to Palestinians, including the cutting off of neighborhoods, the closing off of more shops, and increasing pressure of Palestinians to abandon the area, as it is already the case with Shohada Street and its peripheries. We hope that the coming special rapporteur make a clear and immediate action on this case. At this occasion, we call on this Council to base the appointment solely on expertise rather than any other consideration. And one more time, we thank the leaving Special Reporter for his exemplary work. Thank you.